G'day, it's Kathy from The Land Down Under. Welcome to the Alien 3D March Alien Box Unboxing. Okay, let's see what we got here for March. So, once again, a note from Josh, which is always great to read. What a couple of months it's been and I hope you and each and every one of you is staying safe and healthy throughout the pandemic. It's definitely been crazy times and for those of you who have stuck around with me, I truly appreciated it. If anyone did not receive their updated email from me, please let me know. If you'd like to be added to the email list for any future subscriber only information, I'm absolutely trying to stay as transparent as possible with everyone and I have to agree uh, Josh is a fantastic communicator he is uh, very honest with uh, the issues that he's having and he always keeps us up to date on uh, any difficulties he might be having getting the boxes out and I really appreciate that because it's a very rare quality these days amongst people and it's absolutely fantastic to see uh, my goal with this, the project this month, since I had to find something that didn't require me to rely on another company shipping and be able to acquire enough of them, was to cutely decorate your printer for St. Patrick's Day. Face farm. Well, I definitely didn't make that date, but hopefully you'll find a use for it. Maybe if you have kids, they'll find it enjoyable. The accessory, though, if I'm sure, everyone can find some use for. For I know I have about five of them as I keep losing them and getting more just to find the previous one again I, I'd lost. Always, any feedback anyone has, feel free to reach out. The next few months should be should run a bit more smoothly. <laughs> raises, uh, uh, raises fists at shipping fairies. Yeah, it's a little bit difficult with shipping and stuff at the moment. So we've got a bunch of stickers in here and I think some of them may have come from the previous month's box because the reshipper has a habit of opening the boxes and taking everything out and not putting them back where they're supposed to be. So there's an LDO Motors. Project FDL. Make... Um, Good. Now, yeah, a couple of life remaining room board there. <laughs> Shooters of uh, you know, darts and things. <laughs> There's an Alien 3D sticker. Uh, filament colours. Uh, this is a great site to go to. It's uh, filamentcolors.xyz. If you're looking for a particular colour, Filament, there's a fantastic library of colours there that you can um, check out from lots of different manufacturers. This is uh, pipsmountain.com. This is Cocoa Press. This might have come from Earth. There's an Earth 2019 sticker. It's a Spool Boss sticker. Nerd Life is like regular life but with 3D printers. Wham Bam. Wham Bam are great. I've got a Wham Bam PLA sheet on my printer at the moment. It works fantastic. It's another Protopasta sticker. And let's have a look what we've got for filament. Monoprice High Gloss Peel Green. Which is a pretty nice green, that one. Oh, that's a nice gold. Bright gold PLA from Village Plastics. And this 
this is Green Great Green Gate 3D Spearmint Recycled PETG. Lastly is Polymaker Peel Polylight PLA. And exactly what uh, Josh was talking about snips. Can never have too many pairs of snips. Coming in handy for the projects as well as your 3D printer. And there is a little set of. They might actually be uh, LED lights, I think. Oh, one more sticker. My nozzle is hardened. It's a nice uh, shiny metallic one. And a little uh, chocolate coin. So that's it for the March box. And thanks very much, Josh. Appreciate your efforts. Uh, stay safe and look after yourselves. Thanks very much for watching. And I'll see you when my next lot of boxes arrive from the reshipper in the US. Thanks very much. Bye for now.